Okay, it's the cycle with the machine, part two, one year update of Magic 7.0. This is the um, comforter that I put in in the first video, part one of the one year review, and it spins it pretty good. Pretty damn good. I'm gonna stop it just to show you what's in there. Still 30 minutes left. This, this is on um, the first rinse cycle. I'm gonna pause it for a second just to show you how well it works. See the comforter? Put it back on. I mean, this this machine is well worth the money. And this is great for like, you know, if you have a one bedroom or even a two bedroom, you don't have that many people might have one other person staying with you um, you can use this machine I see nothing wrong with this machine I like it because if it breaks there's parts available for it um, and it's a top loader I have front loader machines and the always the problem of the balance of it, it would eventually the spider arms on it would break so I went back to the traditional top load which I never really had a problem even though they all do that down the line but this machine is well worth the money I spent for it I don't know how much it will be now that I bought this a year ago uh, with inflation it's probably a little bit higher I paid a little over four hundred dollars for this um, but it's up to you um, the quality of the machine top notch Everything works as if it was from the first day that I brought it. So I overall give this machine five stars. I'm not getting paid for this. I'm just doing this because the average person don't know. They're looking for something affordable, especially the cost of those top load, those um, front loader machines are over a thousand dollars a piece, and to me, they're not worth it. So overall. This is one hell of a machine to invest a few hundred dollars in. I will go for it.